The following program is rated TV Immature. It contains potentially offensive content, including coarse language and ethnic stereotyping. Also, neither of the hosts is qualified to critique food. The opinions expressed by them should be completely disregarded. Viewers that are easily offended should close their browsers at this time. Hey, I'm Adam, and I'm a film student from Indiana. And I'm Gian. I'm a student from Naperville, and I'm really hoping to learn about the changing food landscape in our city. Come with us and see what happens as we get to know the city and each other while we eat Chicago. What are we doing today? Trying out good foods. Can't wait. We're in the city, and um, something that's really known about the city, it, it's really known for its food, right? So what do you have in mind? Um, Asian. Chinese? Asian. Yeah. All right, cool. And then we'll meet up later? Yeah. Awesome. Cool. Peace out, man. Adam is going to the original location of Lao Xie Swan at 2172 South Archer Avenue in the heart of Chinatown. This ultra-casual restaurant was opened by Chef Tony Hu in 1989. They have a huge menu that focuses on traditional Chinese dishes as well as some more Americanized fare. Adam is picking up an order of one of their most requested dishes, twice fried pork with chili peppers. If you like heat, this is the dish to order. Of course, we have no idea what Adam's tolerance level is, so this could be interesting. Food! Jian is on his way to the newest location of Lao Xie Swan, located at 520 North Michigan Avenue, in the heart of the magnificent Mile Shopping District. With lush modern decor and a fully stocked bar, it's definitely much more of a fine dining experience than the original location. Jian will be getting the Hunan chicken, which is one of their less spicy options. It should balance the heat in Adam's dish well. I told her good. Hey, Back man. In the kitchen. What's going on? Good. It's been a long day. Hey, I got some Hunan chicken. <laughs> Twice fried pork. What? Twice fried pork. Twice fried pork. Twice. <laughs> Uh, I hear mine's a little spicy, so we should have fun with that. I hate spicy food. No, oh, mine's spicy because it's gonna bang you in your ass twice because it's that spicy. Holy shit, is that, that's red chili peppers. Yeah. On top of, literally like on top, okay. Home. I, I'm excited. Wait, wait, we're missing something, right? Yeah, what? What are we missing? What the? Where did these come from, man? Um, Europe. Well, are you ready to dig in? All right, okay, uh, What do you think? No. It's hotter than Megan and Fox naked. You try it? You try that, I'm gonna try this. Of course, it wouldn't have been so spicy if either of our hosts had been smart enough to realize that you aren't supposed to actually that's eat spicy. the chilies in the dishes. Um, wow, that's what she said. Can we try that snapping thing again and get some more water back in my uh, cup? While the dishes presented today are definitely most appealing to diners with a palate that can tolerate a high level of spice, they can be made to order with as little or as much spice as you like. While the host complained about the heat, yeah, sure. there were no leftovers, and we strongly encourage viewers to give both of these restaurants a try. Sure. Oh. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that stuff was hot. Makes you want to do some kung fu. No, no, it doesn't. All right, man. Yeah. Okay, cool. Well, uh, that was fun. Let's do it again, man. What did, what did you think about the food? God, I like it. My ass is going to fill it later. Yeah, I'm good now. I'm good now. That snow really did me well. Um, so, what do you think it? Next time, Mexican? Yeah, not spicy though. No spicy. No spicy. Alright, cool. Let's get out of here. You will have a hot day with Dion's mom. You have a hot date with my mom? Yeah. Yeah, fuck no. That's not happening. <laughs> Ever. Happening, Ever, dude. man. Hey, no, it's no. fate. All I gotta say is, I'm cute as a teddy bear. Mm -hmm. You're cute as a teddy Let's see if there's a fortune cookie for that. What do you think, huh? Should be. Should be? Hmm. Okay, let's see. 
Adam is a dick. Whoa, that I came out of. No, it says Adam has a big dick. Oh, you read it wrong. Shit. I guess I read it wrong. Well, that's too bad for you, Adam. My mom doesn't like big dicks.